Hello everyone, welcome to Crochet Life and Stuff with Deborah presents Tuesday Reviews and another one in our Snacks Around the World series. This is something from Korea. Um, the only word that I can identify on uh, the entire uh, package that's not stuck on the back is sour. It was in the candy section so it got my attention and by what's on the back I mean, these were brought in for import. There is a sticker in English and American terms over all of the Korean information that was on there. Now on the front, this does purport to have, it looks like uh, B1, B2, and B6. I don't know. I don't know what that means, but I'm gonna tear into it and find out. Um, there's something in there, it's like a, it's, it's been puffed up with air. Um, Servings per container, one. Serving size, 50 grams. It says Bacchus Jelly Sour. Sour, yes. I'm hoping that it's really super sour. Let's rip this packet open and see what it's got for me. Ooh, mm. I smell something sour. Oh wait, it's got a Ziploc in it too. Oh, okay. The whole packet is a serving size, but it's actually, let me get the top bit off there. They're individual jellies. It looks like, yes, they're like a jelly candy, like a gummy, and they're coated with something that's probably sour inducing. That is my guess. They're squishy. Let's see what they do. They're definitely chewy. They're not real sour. Of course, this is coming from a girl who would eat lemons, just like lemons, you know. They're too sour for the hubby. I know that. But <clears throat> as far as sour candies go, they are pleasantly sour, but no extra pucker value. They're not like a warhead or anything like that, but they are quite good. And I'm not usually one for gummy candies, but the flavor is on point. And unlike most American candies, the first ingredient on this is sugar. It's not corn syrup or anything. The second ingredient is, is uh, starch syrup that has some other things, including citric acid, pectin, emulsifier, vitamins. Yeah, so it has some vitamins added to it because, you know, healthy. But um, yeah, I'll be able to snack on these a little bit later on because you don't have to have the whole packet at once. Uh, the total carbs in a whole serving, which is the whole packet, which is 50 grams, is 175. That's calories, so it's, that's calories. The carbs is 40 grams for the whole packet because it is real sugar. Um, yes, I do have diabetes. Yes, I did dose before I started chomping on this, okay? I do use the old noggin sometimes, but yeah, not a pucker face like this guy is given in a little cartoon picture, but not bad for a sour lover. Not bad. Would I buy them again? Probably. These were, uh, I think, $1.99 for this. H Mart was the location. If you don't know what an H Mart is, that is an enormous Korean supermarket chain that... Um, I don't know if they're around the world, but I know they're all over the U.S., at least in major metropolitan markets. We have to drive um, over an hour, hour and a half-ish, one way, <clears throat> to get to one of the many H Marts that are in the Atlanta area, because we're way north of Atlanta. But um, we love to go there to go do shopping. We bring the cooler and do the whole thing, and I like to pick out fun little things to try that I haven't tried before. So, yeah. 
these Bacchus Jelly Sours, or at least that's what the English name is on the sticker on the back. They're all right. If you like sour stuff, and you like, it's like citrusy and, and lemony, you'll like this. If you want it to be super mega face puckering sour, that might disappoint you a little bit. But all in all, yeah, I like them. Thanks for joining me today for this edition of Tuesday Reviews, doing a little bit of a snacks around the world thing because of my trip to H Mart and uh, some other places. So uh, make sure you join me. The, the playlist down below is for all of the Tuesday Reviews, which aren't just food. Sometimes it's movies, sometimes it's other products. You never know what I'm gonna decide to spout my opinion on. On <laughs> Tuesday reviews. But thank you for joining me. Hit that like button on your way out. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you next time.